Uh, my name is Deborah Ballardini and I'm the co-founder of Punto Space, co-founder of RIP.BR, the only Brazilian theater company in New York City, and also the co-founder of the Nettos Artist Collective. So Inside the Wild Heart is an immersive theatrical performance that uh, I co-create, I also co-produced and I performed in uh, with RIP.BR. Sometimes it's like, oh, why? Why is she moving so much? You know, why is she expressing herself so much? Um, that has to do with awareness. And sometimes people that are close to you and you're trying to express yourself, uh, people that are close to you, they don't know how to react to, to that because they are not a, uh, aware of their bodies or they're not aware of their presence. So that can come to a shock. Um, you can do this experience, you can be open with somebody and if they are open, they will just give it right back to you. But if they are not, that's when the stigma and the shock comes into place. Theater to me is yoga practice. I don't have to be on a headstand, I can just be in front of an audience and I'm doing yoga. And what I mean about that is the level of concentration and presence. You know, in yoga you have to be present to your breath at all times. In theater, you have to be present in acting, not just in theater, but in acting. You have to be present at all times. You have to breathe. And if you don't, then you lost yourself. You start having this big bubble here in your head saying, what am I doing here? You know, is the spotlight gonna fall in my head? Or well, what is the audience saying? Um, you know, what are they thinking? So immediately you are out of your meditation, right? If you start questioning and if you start judging yourself or judging anything. So that's where Hatha gets into me. And I take that practice of Hatha yoga um, and, uh, and th my theater training, which to me are so, so the same thing, um, to my daily life, right? If I'm having a meeting and I'm not present, then I'm not there. If I don't breathe when I get upset about something that happens, you know, in my work environment, then I have to breathe. Or I just have to be honest with myself, which is exactly the same thing as, as theater and yoga. You have to be honest with yourself and express body and express with your voice, with your words. I don't feel good right now. Can we take five um, so I can be present again? Right now I'm not. Um, of course, when you are performing, you can't ask the audience, can I take five? <laughs> um, but sometimes it can happen in situations, uh, extreme situations, you may say, excuse me, I need five minutes, let's restart. Um, you got to be honest with yourself and be present. That's like for everyday life. I just want to say a super thank you uh, for being there, um, gathering and uh, having amazing energy in this sip and chat and toast and vote. I, I, lo I love the title. It's so beautiful and so difficult for me to say, but I have fun every time I say it. Uh, thank you so much, Dillis, uh, from Sip and Chat. Um, this is so wonderful. Thank you, Kashana, for opening up you know, the Zen Den and having this amazing toast for art, basically. And um, if there's a moment that we need the most is right now. You know, um, these awards that I'm running for are not just for me, are not just for my you know, pleasure, but it's for everybody because I tend to bring everybody with me wherever I go. So thank you, thank you so much. Have fun.